Hey guys, it's Natasha. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to me studying for my finals. It is currently Thursday. My final is on Monday. Monday at 9 a.m. girl. So yesterday I didn't vlog and the day before I didn't vlog because I forgot I was like deep into it and I was like, you know what? Let me let me just start today. Right now I'm just finishing up my TikTok recording editing for the day. I think I have about like maybe one hour more of work to put into that and then I'll go right into studying. But I wanted to introduce a video and be like, tell you what's up. Third semester of nursing school. I have three finals to do. One is next Monday. The other one is next Tuesday. And then one is on Thursday. If anything, I'll just look back at my calendar. The hardest one is on Monday. The other ones should be easy because one of the classes are very similar to the other class that I took. One's a public health class and I took a community health class and a lot of the concepts overlap. And then the other one is a research final. I'm putting all my focus and my noggin into that med search final. I have a review tonight is at six. I have six chapters to put in my noggin. Joke's on me, I didn't read the instruction. The exam review is at one o'clock, it is 1.11 and I need to take the Uber to my university because it's on campus. And I thought it was at 6 p.m. Okay, bye. So I was ready to have like this really nice, relaxed transition from my like working time, studying time. And I'm like, you know, I'm gonna study for X amount of hours. And then tonight at six, we're gonna head over to this review. My friend texts me, she's like, are you at the review? <laughs> I'm like, what do you mean? It's at six. She's like, no, it's right now. Good thing I had everything else ready, showered and all that stuff. I said, picked the first thing I saw that thought would look Good together i've worn this before so i knew it like would match ran out the door went to this review the review was not what i thought it was going to be went anyways and now i'm going to actually start reviewing so yesterday i used the pomodoro method to study and i found it very effective there's this like two hour youtube video it has like the timer i have it in the background and then when it's the time's up it rings so like i know the time is up and i don't have to like keep watching it and then I have a five minute break that feels like two seconds. I swear every time I grab my phone to open TikTok and then the timer rings again and I put it back down, back to studying. But it was effective yesterday. I'm gonna do that again. I'm gonna, I'm in chapter nine. So I have chapter seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 to study. I've done seven and eight, started nine yesterday. I'm gonna finish nine and complete 10. And then tomorrow the plan is to do 11 and 12. Which the thing is, all of the chapters until 10, I have already like heard the lecture at least once, but 11 and 12 I have not. So tomorrow when I do 11 and 12, it's gonna be all new information. I have to be speed writing notes. Grab this, I have all my chargers in here. I'm gonna bring my water bottle. Spiduling! I know it says Spidu Cream, but the real ones know the OG name was Spiduling. Bring this go up so I have a chair. Yesterday, studying in my bed was so uncomfy for my back. I really need to put my office together. Part of me wants to return the desk because I don't even have a chair. I would still need to get a chair and then I'll have to decorate that whole room. If you guys don't know, I have an office in my apartment, a room that right now we just use for storage. But I was like, planning to like declutter it, which I started doing and put an office in there. So I bought my desk. I've had that desk since what? Since I moved in here in May. Have not built it because I'm like, should I just like not build it? just go to the study whenever I need it and sell the desk. The desk was like $200 or something. I haven't even opened the box. I don't know. Anyways, we're gonna go up to the office or the library, whatever it's called. I'm looking up the Pomodoro method on YouTube so I can start the countdown. It's a neurological uh, innervation. Also, you wanna be monitoring the client for risk of infection. Oh, we haven't talked about it, you guys. Break time. I need to start, stop getting so comfy in this area. I need to sit back up. I am two hours and three minutes into studying. They, I just got a 25 minute break. <laughs> that was a crazy face. That break was more than 25 minutes and you and I both know that. Two beautiful days to save lives. <laughs> It's gonna work. I am back in my room like 10 30 and I was not about to cook so I ordered some Uber Eats and I'm gonna eat that every time it's finals week or any like midterm prep I never have time to cook and basically the entire week is Uber Eats. I was gonna be like you know what Natasha save money we'll make something but I was on Uber Eats and they're having a promo code so I ordered two meals for $28 so one's gonna be for today one's gonna be for tomorrow. Just chicken fried rice. Oh, is this miso soup? Spring rolls. Mm. 
Oh, it's fine. Oh, I don't have any juice. Sad. Ooh, that looks so good. I'm going to be enjoying this and then taking my makeup off and go to bed. Let's do one bite to see if it's good. I hope it is. That's a pee. Scary. Mm. It's next day. I finished all my filming and stuff and posted everything for today. I have my bag packed. I need to put on pants because I feel like it might be a little cold up there. I'm wearing shorts. Like, I'm not naked. Am I wearing the same sweatshirt from yesterday? Yes, because I literally wore it for like 10 seconds yesterday. I'm starting earlier today. Yesterday, I started around like 4. Right now, it's 1 o'clock. So hopefully that will give me more time to, you know, get more studying done. I thrifted these white sweatpants and they're from Aritzia and they were 10 bucks from the thrift store. I think someone accidentally donated this and I'm like, <laughs> you're lost my game. <laughs> I don't know if I want to wear these though. Do I? I'm going to just wear these gray ones from Target because I have makeup on and I feel like I'm going to touch my face and touch the pants and then get them stained. I am notorious for having stains on everything i need to be more careful my clothes <laughs> i need to take care of my clothes better okay i'll have these on hopefully i learn a lot today i was ready to head out the door to go up to the library and i got a package okay this is from kapari kapari beauty cleaner than clean skincare for everybody y'all know how i feel about a no y'all know how i feel about a no y'all know how i feel about a no mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. Bro, this will never get old. This will never get old. I mean, like, you want to send me a little package? Okay, we have lip gloss. A tinted coconut flavored lip balm that hydrates and adds shine. Y'all know how I feel about lip products. Moisturized whipped ceramide cream. It comes with a little scoop. Then we have a guava hydrating body wash. Body bumps be gone with 10% AHA. Oh wait, period. I'm literally gonna try this when I get in the shower tonight. They have Guava Ultra Restore Body body Butter. Hold up, let's get into this. That smells good. It's making sure I got everything out. This one time I got a package and I didn't do this and I went to throw it out and an air tag fell out, like a, in a an air tag in a box and I almost threw out the air tag. I'm excited, I'm really excited to try the Bumps Be Gone. I'm gonna tell you the tea about that. And also I'm a gloss girl, so you know, I'm gonna tell you the tea about that too. And we're back. I just finished a five hour study sesh. I'm hungry and I'm so glad that yesterday I ordered two meals on Uber Eats because I'm gonna warm up one of them and I'm gonna eat it right now. So I came up, right? Came up, warmed up my food. It was wonderful and delicious by the way. Ate it up so fast I said, oop. Forgot to film that. And then I started scrolling on TikTok and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go back downstairs at eight o'clock. Mind you, it's 8.56. And I was like, let me just do one finger and see if the nail turns out good. And then I'll just do as much as I can until eight and then until eight. And then at eight o'clock, I'll go back down. But then I was so far deep, I did the rest. I don't know if you can see. I was so far deep, I was like, I need to finish it. So now it's 8.56, an hour later, that I attempted to do, but I told myself I cannot go to bed without finishing chapter 12. I have three videos left for chapter 12. So I'm gonna pack my bag, go back up to the library. Hopefully no one's there because sometimes I use that room for like events and whatever, whatever. Hopefully no one's there, finish it up and I'll be done chapter 12. And then tomorrow and Sunday, review, 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 review. Happy Saturday. I was supposed to wake up at nine and instead of clicking snooze on my alarm, I clicked stopped and then I woke up at 11. I could have gone, I could have kept going. I could have kept going, but I had to record a TikTok, which I already posted. Oh, I'm so tired, bro. I went to bed at 2 a.m. That's my fault because I was on TikTok. I did my makeup today, but I don't like how it turned out. <laughs> but it's okay. Some days are good for learning. Some days are good for keeping you humble. Be humble. <laughs> Sit down. And tea ways. I need to study today. I have this thing where if I'm really productive for a lot of days in a row, there's like one day where I'm like, I rock. I can't do that. I can't do that because my exam is, it's Monday at 9 a.m. That's crazy for them to do that. I'm sorry. That was actually illegal, which means I have today and tomorrow to study. So if I rock today, 
I'm gonna be real stressed tomorrow. Wish I didn't rot today. Been using the Pomodoro method all these days. It's been working beautifully. Yesterday I got in like one and a half Pomodoro videos. Each video is six hours long. I got some study under my belt. Today and tomorrow is just review. Review, 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 review. I'm gonna go get ready. I was gonna run in bed for a little longer, but it's one o'clock. I should start studying, so I need to change my outfit and stuff. Or actually, my makeup's not that bad. I need to put on like a sweat, some sweats or something. I think I want to wear this set. This is from Elwood. I really just need to get another Elwood set because I only have one Elwood matching tracksuit, and then I have a couple like t-shirts, long sleeves, and then some shorts. But I just need. <gasps> What is that? It's stained. Anyways, but I need to get another matching set. No three today, through and through. Tell you everything, like at the top of my head right now, I can tell you that if someone has kidney problems and you want to do a health history, you want to see if they have diabetes, you want to see if they have hypertension, you want to see if they have chronic heart failure, you want to see if they have any neuro generative disease like Parkinson's or MS because that can affect their peeing and if things aren't firing, neuros, neurotransmitters aren't doing their thing around like the urinary tract and that can lead to UTS, that's another kidney problem. Or you want to see if they're in old age or you want to see if they have any kidney, like kidney clearance issue. That's what I need to do and want to be able to do by the end of the day for my first three chapters. And then tomorrow I'll do the second three chapters. I also want to go to bed at a reasonable time tomorrow. So I don't mind going to bed late today because I'm setting not because I'm watching TikToks, girl. You can you can watch all the TikToks you want. Natasha, you can watch all the TikToks you want Tuesday. I mean Monday after 12. You're right, you're right. So the plan is to maybe go to bed late today studying to get to really get those three chapters in my brain. And then tomorrow I'll get the other three chapters. I'm not the type of person that studies right before getting into exam. Like when I walk into an exam and I see the sea of people, this one's in person, I see the sea of people and everyone has their books out and they're trying to memorize things last minute, no. The second I wake up the day of the exam, I know what I know, I don't know what I don't know, and I won't know what I don't know. Leave it be. I'm gonna use context clues, process of elimination, and cross my fingers that I'll do well at that point because I'm not stressing myself out last second. I need to be in a zen study space. Like, I need to be like floating, like <laughs> floating as I get out into that exam. Oh, the green from this matches the sleigh. I'm gonna put on filler. Not this one. Missing person, Ugh, this stuff. At first, when I first smelled this at the store, I was like, I sprayed it and I'm like, this doesn't smell like anything. And I still like sprayed it on me. I went throughout my day and I'm like, there's something that smells so good and I couldn't put my finger on it. And then I realized that it was that perfume. So then I bought it, I had it. And then I had that accident where it fell and it cracked. I had it in my gym bag and it went all over the floor and I said, and then Fleur saw that video or another video that I did of them and they sent me a restock. I was making a list of karaoke songs. I can't sing, but I think I can like hold a note. Like bare minimum, that's what I can do. Bare, like don't, don't be like, oh girl, you think, no, no. I know my capabilities and I know my abilities and I know my limitations. Anyways, I was trying to figure out what note I can hold, like what note that is. So if I sing in a karaoke ever, if I'm ever like, oh, we're doing karaoke, that I can at least show the best note that I can hold. You know what I'm saying? So I found out that I can hold a G, like the songs that are in a G key, I guess. And I found a list and I tried singing them and I was like, okay, this is, a, this is the note. I just had to double check. And I started writing a list on my notes app. Like I'm saying, if I, I never want my notes app to be revealed because everything in my notes app goes from like my deepest, darkest secrets to like, list of karaoke songs that if I'm ever put in a scenario ever I'm prepared, I can whip out the list and be like, we're gonna sing this one because I can I can confidently say that I can at least hold that note. And people are not gonna be like, oh my goodness, that's the best note I've ever heard, but it's not gonna hurt their ears. Anyways, that's a side note. Get it? Haha. <laughs> I have my thick pick. I have my charges in here. I also really need to go grocery store shopping because my fridge is Last night at precisely 1 a.m. I got influenced by another TikTok again. A hundred dollars later. Why is acetone 20 bucks? Anyways, 
because y'all this is so many side stories before i go to study and i have nothing else to tell you but you know i did my nails don't look too close they look kind of cute oh okay and i was like you know what i'm just gonna go back to do my own nails because if you've seen my tiktok stories of uh, 101 disappointments every time i go to the nail salon i pay an arm and a leg and i still end up mad then i was like you know what let me just go back to it because during covid i did my own nails here are a couple of pictures of how i did my nails and i'm like looking back and i'm like girl you kind of slayed just do it yourself we won't be mad and it lasts and whatever i have a nail kit in my house in cali but not all the stuff is here and even though i have that kit when i go visit my parents i'm gonna bring it back whatever whatever but there's some things that i was missing so i had to restock up on those which led to the 100 dollars amazon purchase because one item of acetone was 20 bucks i don't even know why that's even legal anyways i made the order and it's coming in today tomorrow and i'm hoping it comes in monday because i know if it either comes all the stuff either today or tomorrow then i'm gonna want to do my nails again with the new stuff that i got and i'm not gonna focus on my studying anyways just to tell you yesterday i spent 100 dollars on amazon i got a new uv light because mine broke i had that one for three years it finally broke i got some more gel i got the 20 dollar acetone and then i got some tips so i'm gonna whenever that comes in i'm going to attempt it and i'll put that on my tiktok i need my keys i have my water currently 351 i have a 30 minute break maybe i should go out and eat i'm gonna do that i have 25 minutes left ran upstairs i'm making myself a sandwich because that's the easiest thing to do and i also don't have a lot of things to get creative with right now just ham and cheese to get that cheese to melt I'm going to do a side of sour cream and onion chips and some water. I'm trying to be really strict with the times and the breaks and stuff so I can stay on track because I know if I'm like, oh, I'll just take an hour and then it was going to just push me back. So if the food ain't done, I ain't eating. I ordered tacos the other day and it came with the lime cilantro sour cream crema, whatever it is, and it's really good. I think I'm just going to put some on my sandwich just to give it some razzle dazzle. Could this meal have been more nutritious? Yes. But I'm in a time and crunch. I'm gonna eat this and then I'm gonna head back upstairs to keep the studying. I just finished a five hour study session. Oh, it's currently. It's seven. <laughs> it's so bright outside that I forget. I thought it was 3 p.m. I think we're gonna be here for a long time. It's currently 8 12. I just made my Uber Eats order. I'm just, there's no time to cook. Next finals week, I'm going to meal prep before the week starts so i have food to eat i went to my apartment to grab some utensils i need to go anyways because i needed to refill my water bottle so check-in time it is 1208 i'm still here i have i'm on my break right now break i have three more question banks to do that is in conjunction with today's materials and i was going to be like okay i'll just go to bed and do them tomorrow but i want to finish all the material that i set for today today hmm. it's 1 a.m and i'm going to bed it's the last day before my exam my exams tomorrow at 9 a.m it's currently 10 57 and i'm heading down to study right now i'm starting two hours earlier than i usually do i've been starting at one each day because I need the time. So I woke up, I filmed my videos for the day, I posted them. Even though I've been posting on TikTok, I feel distant because I'm like, I go straight into studying. I feel like I'm on robot mode, just like trying to be present on the app, but also study, you know? So got up, did that, just ate some breakfast, which is perfect, cause I fed. And now I'm gonna head up to go to the library and we're probably gonna be there till hopefully, 10 p.m. I want to be well rested tonight. Like if I don't know it after 10, that's my problem that I didn't start studying earlier. But I need to be well rested, not stress, have a good night routine. I'm gonna be studying for the next hours, 11 to 10. Okay, so I feel like I said this study tip in my last video, but I'm gonna just say it again. Right now I'm reviewing yesterday's content before I dive into today's content. And there's still some stuff on dialysis that I'm not really sure about, specifically peritoneal dialysis. So what I do is because I'm not really understanding how my teacher is teaching it as I'm reading the notes and listening to her, I go on YouTube, look up 
like a cute five minute video on it watch it and then get a different the same like the same information from a different instructor and sometimes that helps better because the way they present the information makes more sense to my brain it's 12 22 my exam is tomorrow at 9 a.m do i feel ready i don't I don't know if I do. I don't know if I do. Oh, my days. <laughs> I think I, I don't know if, if I studied harder for this or for, or the, for the midterm. I just want at least, at least an 80. This class is hard, bro. There's just so much stuff like, even if I had longer, I mean, if I had longer time then I probably would know more things, but even that, it's just like, there's so many details and, a lot of things look kind of the same, but they're different. And I gave a good, this is not A for effort. This is E for effort. Like I put in the work compared to how I studied for my midterm. I feel like for my midterm, I studied, but only like a couple hours, like each day, like maybe two or three hours, call it a day. And then the day before, I just need to be confident in what I know. Like I say, my motto, I know what I know and I don't know what I don't know and I won't know what I don't know. I'm going to, go upstairs do my night routine hopefully i do well <laughs> good night